Hello everyone, I have waited the whole week uh, for having a little sun and do this video with inner flight but the sun won't come so I try to mm, to make it with just uh, the light of the apartment so I wanted to show you my work about air of this week uh, first my element and book what I've changed um, I have found on internet something about um, the Egyptian Egyptian cycle um, with the gods about the day and the night so for the morning in the east you have Kipri I hope I say it good for noon you have warm and for um, for dusk you have Atum at west and for the night you have Osiris um, just uh, something I wanted to to keep and remind um, it can be great and this one I have already shared with you and this one is new too it is about, it is about the Eightfold Pass Buddhist Eightfold Pass um, and is as um, talked about in the Question Pass and I wanted to keep it um, the, the names are not necessarily good with the, the elements but I wanted to keep the idea of the elemental cycle so you have first the right view and after the right intention and the right speech and the right action the right lively livelihood the right effort the right mindfulness the right concentration and i found it really great about um good principles good principles for our living in life so I wanted to keep it too and maybe um, find which one goes for each elemental gradient maybe or maybe not so it's for further work I keep it if I want to do more little things like that I have to put it in another way so my air guardian I have reworked a little on his face more intense in colors I have showed you this and Ruth from our ninth group ninth group ninth group um, I had made a wonderful poem about air when we have made our um, group work about the correspondences so I wanted to do something special with this poem to keep it for me <laughs> and she loved dandelions so I put it on a dandelion and I put it the poem I try to read it to you a great stillness pose all time suspended, the world holds its breath for dark of moon, but then, but then a fate steering movement. Your music surrounds me in the whisper of the trees. Flying, weightless, I leap into the sky, there to celebrate dozens songs on echo on a bird's call. Gentle, insistent, triumphant, you move, surround, embrace. You who are all places, all time, dance here with me now. You see, you know, you share, you move on. A haunting melody sung into the night. Falling, carried, lifted, into the dark earth of space, an endless mystery of now. By Gustav Moore. I love it. And um, I have made some cards for 
air correspondences uh, I didn't put all my correspondences but some like the gods, goddesses um, a good tip if you search on google the wing gods and goddess, uh, goddesses you will have a really good and complete list uh, in all the cultures cultures of the world, of the gods and goddesses, um, I found it really good and there are some plants and some planets I have linked to, um, to the air and the tarot and we, has, we had an exercise to choose um, our best virtues for air that will go to our air guardian and I kept all my favorite ones, a uh, bigger, bigger list of my favorite ones um, in the back so my favorite are inspiration, free spirit, aestheticism Courage, intention, nomadism, and sharpness. And I've done a one with stones, plants, trees, metals, etc. And one of physical attributes, but air. The larger list, the smaller list. And these three words I really. Um, important for me the relation of, of air with mind and time and with yoke. Uh, yoke is the spiritual traditional chant of the Sami. The Sami are the indigenous nobodist people um, of the north of Europe. They live in the north of Sweden of Russia and of um, I don't know Norway in English you say so I am pretty fond of them and I, the York is really wonderful so if you want to try York on internet on Google you find something some really good things and after that we have my water guardian I hope you can see her um, I really fell in love with her a black skinned woman um, with a black panther and really a lot of green beads in the air and she's the shapeshifter it's why there is all these spirals mm, she can really change like the black panther the only thing that stays that's the black color but I can't draw her all in black because it will be just a black thing in the on this paper color and what I have discovered in meditation is that uh, my air guardian and my air what a guardian I in love, <laughs> passionately in love, and they want me to call them Shu and Tefnut, like the god and goddess of air and water in Egyptian mythology. Um, it was really a great moment to see them together, and I love to, when I see the rain and the fog and the clouds, imagine that it's really their passion that melt these elements and after that we add the earth guardian you saw last time and yes not yesterday uh, the day before I saw them my air guardian and my earth guardian playing to dance in spiral you know spinning spinning round and round and and laughing. Um, it was when I saw trees dancing in the, the air and their leaves flying and uh, 
so it's all about their complicity. They are more like brother and sisters to take as a. And so I think it's all. <laughs> All I did for my elemental book, and I wanted to share with you, even it with it, if it is not finished, but it won't really be finished. Um, ow. I have made some cards with a beautiful box made from, um, you know, like um, it was something to eat in the box. So um, I put it on it my favorite image about air. I found it on um, Deviant Art. I don't remember the name of the artist. And um, as I say to Annie, I for correspondence is just putting names, it's just not enough for my head. I really need images and words in order to feel um, infused with the energy of the concept of the things, it sings in. It makes my heart and my head sing together to have a word and an image. So I did these cards like you have Grace with a dragonfly, and on the other side, you have inspiration with this Chalcedony and Amethyst girl and I love the the, um, the hole in the head for the idea that come and goes out of the nostrils and so I can't show you all but like this one Hermitage it's the place where Jack Kerouac um, that stayed in the summer uh, in order to, to mm, I don't know, to spy on the fires and he was all alone and he made uh, some books about it. I love this place and, and then you have heaven with so beautiful clouds and I don't know, this one is feathers with diving and another universe with balance and you have childhood, I love this one <laughs> with dance and I wanted to share with you that you can do it with your favorite images with air and what I love say so like this morning I have picked this one I use it like an oracle um, oracle cards like um, okay today what air want to say to me so I pick up a card and I have one side the first side I see but I can also think about the other side like opening opening to what's in between or my new situation being between one state and another state so just what inspires me from air and I know that a lot of you can maybe love this idea and do this to yourself and it can grow and grow and grow every day with new images, um, I put it the images in some plastic bags. I'm sure you can find something like this on internet. Or so, and the last one, <laughs> my friends loved it for humor. <laughs> we have the all in the nine ninth group um, as our guardian. So I have to let you, it's a long video enough and I love you all, blessed be, <laughs> see you soon.